I was born in what was once former Yugoslavia, um, Serbian mother, Croatian father, Albanian wife, and I was born in Slovenia. Um, and I left and then was back there during the war. And when I was living, you know, I live now in the United States, I started seeing kind of <clears throat> reflaring of nationalism in these things. I started thinking a lot about what happened in my own country. And I knew about the concert, and I thought the concert would be an extraordinary vehicle for a way to talk about what happened. Nanad's very humble, but it was very, very personal story for him, and to, to listen to him talk about it, um, it was really impossible for us not to want to be involved. One of the the most important thing was the multiculturalism of Sarajevo, and when you go there. What is so extraordinary is to have a mosque on one corner and a synagogue on another and a church and an Orthodox church and to hear the tapestry of those sounds of the call to prayer with from the synagogue and the, and the choir. And they have inter-religious inter choirs that sing together on the weekends. It's, it's, it is really something extraordinary. From the moment we heard about this all the way through for me, I would get these cuts, and each cut I would watch was better than the last cut, and it just kept getting better and better. We would get on the phone and, and, and talk for an hour or two, and, and really, he was using me as a sounding board at that point, you know, and then I'd say what he didn't want to hear, which is, okay, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. 